Hi all, welcome to the Urbe Academy. Today we are going to see the one beautiful SQL intro questions which has asked in the recent intros. And let us see, it is the real time use case too. And uh, they will give you the table A and it has contains the column like the ID records are 110 and null and table B contains the column ID and records are one zero null null and what they are asking is what is the output of inner join what is the output of right join what is the output of the left join and uh, in case of the inner join and uh, how exactly we are going to get the record is let me explain inner join what is going to do is it is going to get the all the matching rows from the both tables here the see here the one is matching to the one correct and one k and other one it is also matching to the one okay enter it here and and one obviously it will not match the zero and one it will not match the null and one it will not match the null okay so one one it came and next zero is matching to the one no and next and zero is matching to the zero then it is a common record so so uh, always we will not match to the if you match to try to match to the anything to the null it will be the null only or null cannot be compared and it is not the value that is the reason we will not be considering this null values okay in case of inner join okay and uh, what is the record we are going to get here is the 110 common record between these two tables okay and next what is the what is the answer now inner join is 110 three records we are going to get it okay and let us understand again what is the right join what is the right join definition is we'll get the all the record from the right table okay and non match for the non matching rows we are going to get the null values okay but the um, in the real time how we can calculate is the right join right join is there now how we can definite uh, inner join inner join plus remaining remaining record from remaining record from right table right right table okay inner join what are the records we have already calculated right one one zero okay so one one zero already we have this uh, inner join records and remaining record from the right table what are the remaining one two nulls are remaining that is the reason what we have to mention null 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 okay this is the output okay for the right join similarly similarly what is the definition for what is the definition for left join is left join is inner join inner join plus remaining record from remaining record from left join left uh, left table left table see at the inner join what are the records we have already calculated right one one zero and what is the record is pending here the null is pending now just put it in the null okay this is the output in the real real time they will ask this question whether you are very thorough in the concept wise all those things they are going to check it okay and let us see uh, how um, i will show you the practical way so whether you are going to get the similar things or not okay i have recorded here okay you can see it here okay and what is the output of inner join 110 will be getting what is the output of left join 110 and null will be getting what is the output of right join 110 and null will be getting you can see the exactly here you can see here the this is the inner join record right in the right uh, left join this is the inner join record and right join null null okay and this is the remaining record from the left side similarly okay let us go ahead and uh, understand understand from the practical view okay 
Okay, let us jump on to the practical. Okay, let me go here. I have already taken those records here. Okay, I have inserted the record in uh, table A. See at the one one zero null it is there. And in the table B, I have inserted the record one 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 zero and two nulls are there. Okay, so I what is the uh, what will be getting here is in lab inner join. Let us understand. Okay. And uh, see the I will alias as A, I will give and inner join, inner join table B. Okay, what is the table B and which condition ID column we are going to connect them on A dot here alias is B, A dot ID equal to B dot ID. Okay, then semicolon. Okay, and you execute. I want the only the uh, a dot id. See at one one zero. It is matching, right? Okay, one one zero. It is the in inner join records. Okay, what about the left join and the right join? Okay, take this only. Okay, and change this to left join. Okay, so these are the inner join records, right? 110 inner join record. Okay, and this is the remaining record 110, all the record from the left tables and matching rows from the right tables also. It has displayed, it is matching, right? You can see 110 and null, it is coming. What about the right join? Right join, uh, inner join record plus remaining record from record from right table. Okay. See here. Magic. Inner join records are 110 and remaining records are null. You can see here. Uh, uh, you can see the uh, null, right? 110 plus. Okay. This is the thing. Okay. And I have the challenge for you. Okay. So you need to perform this challenge in your system and then comment the answer in the comment box. Okay. See it. I have the challenge. Table. C and table D, I have given the column I have mentioned, call, you can take the any column. It has the record like the 1, 1, 2, 2, 3 and it, uh, table D has the records 1, 1, 2, 2, 2 and 4 and you guys have to perform the task in your system then comment the answer. Okay, what is the output of inner join? What is the output of right join? What is the output of the left join? Okay, thanks for watching this video. If you like my video, please like, subscribe and share to your friends. It is going to help for them. Okay. Thank you very much, guys.